In Washington, D.C., the new U.S. special envoy to Venezuela, Elliot Abrams, testified on Capitol Hill Wednesday on U.S. efforts to oust Venezuelan President Nicolas Maduro, three weeks after the U.S. recognized the opposition leader, Juan Guaido, as Venezuela's new president. Elliot Abrams is a right-wing hawk who was also linked to the 2002 coup attempt in Venezuela that attempted to topple Hugo Chavez. Abrams was convicted in 1991 for lying to Congress during the iran contra scandal, but was later pardoned by President George H. W. Bush. In the 1980s, Abrams defended Guatemalan dictator General Efrain Rios Montt as he oversaw a campaign of mass murder and torture of indigenous people. Rios Montt was later convicted of genocide. This is Democratic Congressmember Ilhan Omar of Minnesota confronting Abrams over his record Wednesday. In 1991, you pleaded guilty to two counts of withholding information from Congress regarding your involvement in the Iran Kortra affair, for which you were later pardoned by President George H. W. Bush. I fail to understand uh, why members of this committee or the American people should find any testimony that you give uh, today to be truthful. If I could respond to that. Uh, um, it wasn't a question. After headlines. We'll have more on Venezuela after headlines.